Did you know the food you eat can significantly impact your cholesterol levels? When we talk about cholesterol, we're often referring to two key types. Low-density lipoprotein or LDL cholesterol and high-density lipoprotein known as HDL cholesterol. LDL cholesterol, often dubbed as the bad cholesterol, can accumulate in your arteries, forming plaques that can narrow and in time block the passageways to your heart and brain. This can lead to coronary artery disease, a significant health concern. On the flip side, we have HDL cholesterol, our good cholesterol. It acts like a cleanup crew, carrying cholesterol away from your arteries and back to your liver, where it's expelled from your body. This process helps prevent the buildup of LDL cholesterol, safeguarding your health. So, the food we consume can tip the balance of these two types of cholesterol, playing a significant role in determining our cholesterol levels. Here are some commonly made mistakes when it comes to managing cholesterol through diet. Firstly, many of us consume too much saturated and trans fats. Foods high in these fats, like red meat, butter and processed snacks, can raise LDL cholesterol levels. This is the bad cholesterol that can build up in the walls of your arteries and form plaque, leading to issues like coronary artery disease. To manage our cholesterol better, we need to limit these foods and choose healthier fats, such as those found in avocados, nuts and olive oil. Secondly, we often eat too much sugar and refined carbs. A diet high in these can lead to higher triglyceride levels and lower HDL cholesterol levels. To improve our cholesterol levels, it's essential to limit sugary drinks, desserts and white bread and opt for whole grains and natural sweeteners like honey or maple syrup instead. Finally, many of us neglect to include enough fruits and vegetables in our diet. These are excellent sources of fiber and other essential nutrients that can help lower cholesterol levels. Not consuming enough of these foods can lead to an imbalance in our diet, making it harder to manage cholesterol levels. Avoiding these mistakes can help maintain a healthy balance of cholesterol in the body. Now let's discuss alternative foods and simple ways to incorporate them into your diet to help lower cholesterol. The key to managing cholesterol isn't about completely eliminating certain foods, but more about embracing healthier alternatives. Imagine your dinner plate. You might typically have a portion of red meat. Why not replace that with lean poultry or fish? These alternatives are lower in saturated fat helping to keep those LDL cholesterol levels in check. Now let's move to the cooking process. Instead of using butter, consider avocado or olive oil. These provide healthier fats that won't negatively impact your cholesterol levels. What's more, they add a delightful flavor and texture to your meals. When you feel the urge to snack, resist the temptation to reach for processed snacks. Instead, go for a handful of nuts or seeds. These little powerhouses are packed with healthy fats and fiber offering a satisfying crunch that won't send your cholesterol levels soaring. These swaps may seem small, but they can have a significant impact on your cholesterol levels. You're not just making a dietary change, you're making a lifestyle change. Remember, the goal is to lower the bad LDL cholesterol while boosting the good HDL cholesterol. Making these simple food swaps can help reduce your LDL cholesterol levels while boosting your HDL cholesterol. Incorporating healthier foods into your diet doesn't have to be difficult. Let's explore some simple ways to do just that. First, consider adding more plant-based meals into your weekly menu. This could mean swapping out meat for beans, lentils or tofu in your favorite dishes. These foods are not only delicious but also packed with fiber and other nutrients that help lower cholesterol levels. Next, make the switch from refined grains to whole grains. Whole grains like brown rice, oatmeal and whole wheat bread have more fiber and can help lower your LDL cholesterol. Lastly, experiment with different cooking methods. Instead of frying foods in butter or oil, why not try grilling, steaming or roasting? These methods can help cut back on unnecessary fats and calories and they might just introduce you to some new flavors and textures. By making these small changes, you can significantly impact your cholesterol levels and overall health.